days a week. You park that Big Mac truck right in this little garage. Bring a dream, make a stream. Hey, I got this ring. Gobble me, swallow me, drip down the side of me. Bucket and a mop, wop, wop, wop. That's some wet and gushy. Macaroni in a pot. That's some wet and gushy. Huh. macaroni in a pot hi everyone how's everyone doing haven't posted in a while but i'm glad i didn't because in that while a cultural reset has happened um cardi and megan just did that they just did that so i'm gonna paint a bucket and a mop ate some waffles and pancakes <laughs> Did you like that intro? I worked really hard on it. I think it was a missed opportunity for Joanna Sadia, but mm. All right, here we go. I started with the sketch, you can see the light glow. I trace but under is still my sketch though. If you choose some gum, you can erase the lines. Just kidding, that's blue tack. I told some lies. Okay, now I begin to paint the mop. I really hope it's not gonna be a flop. Felt inspired today to write some rhymes. I feel time lapses can be boring sometimes. Yellow and purple, just like in WAP. Willy Wonka vibes? Are you sick of this rap? Let's talk a bit about feminism. Is WAP really garbage or activism? If Cardi B and Megan were male instead, would criticism be so widely spread? All I see is two women doing what they want. Who cares about whatever they wish to flaunt? People act like explicit is something new. The S word, oh my god, it's so taboo. I'm being sarcastic, it was just a thought. Anyway, I'm gonna go grab some macaroni in a pot. I didn't want to get my pot dirty, okay? It's hard to wash. I'd rather wash this bowl. Anyway, I added some glitter details to the painting after I painted it and I thought that was nice. So the next part is some satisfying glitter painting without my nasty voice on top of it. So I hope you enjoy it and I'll be here eating my mac and cheese. Bring a bucket and a mop. This is the final piece in my sketchbook. I think it looks really nice. I especially like the glitter details and they really sparkle in the sun. I'm really glad that this is part of my sketchbook now because now when I show people my sketchbook, actually, you know what? Let's do a sketchbook tour since we're already here. Hi, this is Nicole. What she's saying right now is not important so I thought I would jump in. Deanna and I have had some drama but it's all good now. I know you all miss me in the last videos, don't worry, I'm still here. I will try to be more available for the next cooking narration. Okay, bye. So yeah, I bought this really nice, expensive sketchbook at the beginning of the year, and I thought that I would become a serious artist and fill it up with like really nice things and post every day on my Instagram. <laughs> yeah, that never happened. Um, but I think I got something way better out of it. <laughs> Also, a really quick update on me holding my own hands. Um, I think they did really well. They're a permanent part of my toilet right now because I think that's the best place to put them. And also because this plaster kind of smells like plaster. So if you put it anywhere in your house, it's all gonna smell like plaster. But in the toilet, there's a lot of like air going through. So it just never smells like plaster. Was that explanation necessary? Absolutely not. I'm gonna put this down now because my wrist kind of hurt. If you wanna see the video where I made those, I'm gonna put it up in the eye. Okay, you know the drill. If you like this video and you wanna see more videos like this one, subscribe. My Instagram and Twitter are linked down below, but I also put them up on the screen. If you have any ideas for what you want my next video to be, comment them down below and I'll see y'all next time. You know.